There was not early containment. That oil has flowed down the coastline. The impacts were uh, devastating economically to our wildlife, to our fishing stock, uh, to, the, to the sense of security and uh, serenity of the area. It's very clear what those biological and ecological impacts were in Santa Barbara County. There's over 400 birds and marine mammals that were either collected dead or rescued very oiled. Spills can take a really long time to clean up. They can have impacts that are really long lasting. They can have impacts that we don't even see right now, that we may not see for years down the road because they can impact the reproduction of organisms or the food web. It's hard to say what some of the long-term effects will be. I think with Deepwater Horizon, we're continuing to hear about effects to like dolphin breeding. I don't know if we're going to see those effects here, um, but there's some things that we need to um, look out for. It was really important for me that this special committee meet down here in Manhattan Beach in the South Bay. Uh, obviously, there had been you know, the, all the attention, all the noise you know, was focused on Santa Barbara. That was appropriate. There was a ton of damage up there. It was a real problem. But it also impacted our economy here. A couple days after they declared that the you know, mission accomplished, everything was cleaned up, these mysterious tar balls started showing up on the coastline right here in the South Bay, in Los Angeles, and down in Long Beach. And when something like this happens, it impacts a very broad section of the coastline, not just where the actual spill takes place. There's a lot that we need to look at to prevent this from happening, and so we're here to talk about that today, to try to identify what the cause of this was, uh, what we can do going forward to prevent this from happening in the future. We recently defeated an oil drilling project from happening in Hermosa Beach earlier this year, and I remember one of the main things that um, the oil company trying to drill in Hermosa was saying was that we're six blocks from the beach. The chances of it getting to the ocean is like .00001%. This spill in Santa Barbara just shows inland spill, other side of the freeway, still got to the ocean. Not only did it get to the ocean, it traveled all the way down to Orange County. Before the spill happened, they said chances of any problem are, are extraordinarily unlikely. Uh, we've taken all sorts of precautions, and then you know, here we have this enormous spill. And for us, I think it's a good reminder to policymakers that we've got to always do our due diligence and ask tough questions, and there's only so much trust you can have when public health is so, so much at stake. People love the beach in California. It's a major money generator. It's a major quality of life enhancer. And to risk it with these major oil spills is unacceptable.